I think the, the greatest challenge we're faced with right now is uh, more integration, um, both between global health priorities and, and developing uh, universal health care, pandemic preparedness, uh, and all that needs to happen in terms of uh, research and development and funding of that, and health security. Uh, these uh, areas should come together to really build one holistic healthcare system. Uh, and then at the sort of more global level, I think integrating um, healthcare challenges with the challenges that we're facing with wars, uh, displacements, uh, and uh, climate change. Uh, we need to understand how these all feed off each other and that we should be focusing on a holistic uh, response and not forget any parts of that. So I think as a, a global health community, I think the big success in 2023 was really the uh, licensure of the second malaria vaccine. You know, malaria has been a devastating disease for centuries and uh, if not millennia. And, and I think really getting uh, a, a development of, uh, of that second vaccine and, and a true chance to bar, beat that disease is a major, major uh, breakthrough. But at the same time, we have to remember that there are other viral threats. So I think from SEPI point of view, um, you know, as we're getting very close to having a chikungunya vaccines uh, getting licensed with the support from the European Commission, we've supported a, a vaccine from Alneva. And I think that is going to prove to be one of the, the really big steps forward for, for global health in, in the year that we're in. So I think the greatest challenge in 2024 is going to be to move from uh, political uh, declarations and commitments like the UN high level meeting on pandemic preparedness and response uh, to concrete action. So I think there's, you know, there, there's good commitment, but maybe a disappointing uh, focus on, on action. So I think the pandemic treaty discussions that will continue into 2024 uh, need to really drive action in these areas and make sure that all public funding of research and development has equal access at its heart uh, as we uh, find solutions to these problems going forward.